You're dead. You are dead. Bop, boop, beep, bop, bop, boop, bop. Pay attention. This is how it's done. The incidents were limited to a handful of apartment complex, uh, apartment complexes, and the mayor said our dedicated police officers have acted on those concerns. A handful of problems. Only, Martha, do you hear yourself? Only a handful of apartment complexes in America were taken over by Venezuelan gangs, and Donald Trump is the problem, and not Kamala Harris's open border. Americans are so fed up with what's going on, and they have every right to be. And I, I really find this exchange, Martha, sort of interesting because you seem to be more focused with nitpicking everything that Donald Trump has said, rather than acknowledging that apartment complexes in the United States of America are being taken over by violent gangs. I worry so much more about that problem than anything else here. We've got to get American communities in a safe space again. Yeah. And unfortunately, when you let people in by the millions, most of whom are unvetted, most of whom you don't know who they really are, yeah. you're going to have problems like this. Kamala Harris, 94 executive orders that undid Donald Trump's successful border policies. Yeah. We knew this stuff would happen. That's, they that's... bragged about opening the border, Excuse and now me. we have have the consequences and we're living with it you're destroying me right now but frankly we're not going to do better martha unless donald trump calls this stuff out i'm glad yes. that he did Oof. that is how you hand it what a freaking insane way to propose look <laughs> the, the serial killer has only killed at least five people i mean how many people are in america get over it she's like i don't even live in an apartment complex i live in a gated community why do we care about people that live in apartment complexes? They're gross. They're nasty. Can't even afford a, their first home. It, the incidents were limited to a handful of apartment complex, uh, apartment complexes, and the mayor said our dedicated police. You know what's funny? The irony of this is that how many school shootings have there been? A handful. Oh, but we don't use that logic for that kind of thing in the world because that's a big deal, right? Yeah. So maybe a handful, regardless of the situation, is still a lot. And the fact that they're taking over an entire apartment complexes or that an entirely new gang has decided to come into America, take over apartment complex, sell drugs, and start a new gang war with other gangs... And people and these and these rich smug libtards are just like, what's the problem? It's not in my neck of the woods. I'm not affected by it. Why do I have to worry about it? You guys are over here spreading your disinformation. And I'm over here just telling you information. So I'm in a handful of times. Officers have acted on those concerns. A handful. A of handful. Problems. Only Martha, do you hear yourself? Only there's only been one January 6th. Wait, <laughs> I just love that. I mean, that is uh, what she's done. <laughs> Nobody trusts corporate press anymore. <laughs> I'm so glad. I am so glad that JD Vance can handle the media. I, I he's better he's better than Trump when it comes to some of these psychotic ABC anchors. Trump's great doing this kind of stuff, but he he's really good at it. I mean, that was a masterful stroke. He listened to her. He didn't just have an answer queued up, and he used her own language and own rhetoric against her. It's fantastic, fantastico. I love it. I love the way you talk.